welcome back to my youtube channel we're taking the train today um from casablanca to um tangiers and this is my second train already in morocco i was going to say marrakesh in morocco and i just really want to like share the experience of what it's like taking the train um in in morocco so at the moment we're going to tangiers i've said it already but we so i came from marrakesh from marrakesh to casablanca and then from casablanca we're going to tangiers and then from tangiers we're going to fairs by train also then from fairs we're going to marrakesh and my sisters are then going back to casablanca again so technically speaking we're doing like a little circle around of morocco by train um and yes i'm going to be showing in a bit i'm going to be walking around showing you what the um train is like we're taking the like the first class carriage at the moment and um, when i came from um, from marrakesh casablanca i actually took second class um i'm going to try and see if i can get like if i can take a second class train again so i can like share like a video of what nope. that's <laughs> my sister said no <laughs> so i can share a video of what that's like because like it's also like it's cheaper so i should say actually for three people this was 1092 mad um, worked that out in whatever currency you're watching this from but then for um, second class it would have been 738 MED so that's like the price difference it's a two-hour train we're going to get there at 10 past 7 p.m. and it's about 5 p.m. when the train is leaving um, so yeah I'm going to be taking some videos of the train the carriage maybe the train station as well in terms of videos of like train station where the train leaves from so you can see what it's like to take the train in Morocco it's really really cool um, so far it feels like a similar experience taking the trains in the UK and I take trains in the UK lots um, the trains actually leave on time which is really really good um, last time when I was coming from Marrakesh I was like a bit like a bit lazy about like leaving the I was in the coffee shop and I was just like yeah yeah you'll be fine and the guy almost scolded me for like coming late so like they're really like on time with the trains which is really really good and it's clean so far although this is first class so of course it's gonna be clean but it's clean so far which is really 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 good um yeah they have charging ports where's the charging ports see they have charging ports i really love that lamp it's so cute it looks like a bedside lamp that you can take yeah it's really nice oh yes taking trains like it's so cool because you really get to experience and see places just by sitting down and taking the journey somewhere so yeah Maxi. So this is it as you come in. Here is the booth. You click the door and then it opens up. You have places here to store your bag and stuff as you do like on traditional trains. Um, there's more bag storage here but ours is down to us that way. This is actually like a double decker train um, which is quite interesting. So you have downstairs. I'm going to walk downstairs in a bit to show you downstairs and wear my crocs so you walk downstairs and this is where the train actually opens up from obviously the train is moving down right now um they have toilets um you can see this one is busy but the toilets are really clean as well and it's like good enough for you to do whatever you need to do and all the safety stuff that you start you kind of have i really love that it has um the map of Casab um, what is it called again the map of morocco here as well which you can see sorry uh, no 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 i wasn't no it's fine <laughs> oh, okay yeah i'm just making a video of the map <laughs> sorry so this is the map of Morocco and we came from here which is Casablanca um, and from Casablanca we are going to Tangier so we're taking this train all the way to Tangier and then from Tangier we're going to go to where is it now Fez here and then from Fez we're going to go to Marrakesh so it's kind of like a bit of a circle round around Morocco over there but anyway it's kind of cool so um yeah i'm gonna show you the toilet this this is me this is the toilet it's kind of nice it's very decent um for first class toilets i think it's good there's lots of space things as well to like change nappies as well if you need it um honestly it's very clean which is really 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 good all right let's go upstairs so yeah you go upstairs as well on the double it's a double decker train um which is kind of nice there's handrails as well 
and it's really really cool i really really like it there's more toilets so there was a toilet downstairs just downstairs there's a toilet here there's a toilet as well which is really really good um and i love all the technology around it as well like you can see where to eat the signage everywhere it's really really cool this is another train station this is rabat um we're stopping here this rabat is the capital of morocco so they have like a um a dashboard showing the train times and everything so you can see the most of it is in arabic obviously but you can see the time like this is saying tangier and it's showing 1750. the train station is really cool again very like standard by any standard train station which is really really good this is one thing i love about taking the train you can see all sorts of things like this weirdly shipped Building. in construction oh, this is me the entire time going on this is a train from the outside this is the station we just arrived and it arrived perfectly on time actually um, it said it was gonna get here 10 past 7 and it's here at 10 past 7 which is like perfect you barely ever get this in england um the train station is really nice actually um you can't quite see but it's very modern you have lots of same way the one in rabat was um this is tangier um it's very modern and you have like literally all the services facilities that you need um it's really great that someone came with a trolley because we have so many suitcases someone came with a trolley um to help us out with our luggage obviously you pay them a fee which is fair enough but i think that's a fantastic service because otherwise in normal stations by the time you get to the lift honestly you're already like exhausted um and really really needed because have lots of stuff so that's really handy that they have that um but yeah i'm going to show you the central of the station a little bit but i'll probably show you again more of that when we come back during the day because it's quite dark right now a few moments later can you see that waterfall this is in the train station this is so beautiful i can't quite get like a good view but so nice the um train station in tangier it's called Kare Gare Tangerville. Um, it's really beautiful. I think I showed a video of it yesterday. Um, you can get the train to go to Asila, but we might not do that because we were a little bit late for the train. Um, apparently, it costs about 75 dirham. So, we're going to go and check the train time and see if we can still make it. But it's such a beautiful train station. Let me show you. There's a Starbucks over there. It feels very European, not gonna lie but it's really beautiful the shops and there's a, a little plantation upstairs like flowers and stuff where to get tickets and so convenient there's also ticket machines which you can use I used them the other day it wasn't accepting my card but there's ticket machines that you can use which makes it really cool and they are in English as well as Arabic and the rest of the other languages this is a normal train so you can see this one looks a little bit different to the one we took the other day it's not the high speed like fancy train it's just like a regular train um, that we're taking we're going to fairs this is my third train so far in Morocco um, you have someone helping us with a bag he's been really nice actually um, and yeah this is a train to fairs so this is another type of a train station a uh, train that you have it's a little bit different from the one that we had before um we have a compartment so like a two seater compartment like a two set of seats compartment um over there and over there you have an overhead cabin where you can store your stuff and then the one over here as well we are in a compartment um and yeah let me show you the walk around as well so you have this walkway down where you can go all the way. This train 
cost. I think the this is supposed to be first class. It doesn't feel or look like it in comparison to the other one. But again, they're generally clean. It doesn't smell. It's convenient. It's okay. Um, it's old, but it's fine. Um, the, the ticket costs 164 dirham for the first class one. I think the second class, I like to stand the class was a bit less, but like not significantly more in comparison to the one that the first class was a lot more expensive. Um, and the train is a direct train going to Fez. Um, we left at like five minutes past seven, but we are getting there at 11:39 p.m. So that's like over. Uh, so that's what five no sorry eight nine ten eleven over four hours train um so yeah it does your job to be honest can't really can't really complain um we could have gotten like a one that would stop us in between but would like to get there quicker sorry but would have to stop in between get down and change the train so we really didn't want to do that um but yeah again so far it's been consistent it left on time no delays nothing weird has happened which is really what you expect when you, or what you want to get when you take the train. So this is the second train station that we're going to be, um, no, not second, the third. I showed you one in Casablanca. I showed you one in Tangier. And now this is the one in Fez. We are traveling to Marrakesh today. We are getting a train. It's going to take seven hours. Um, it's a very, very long journey. So I have books we're gonna try and buy food everything that we need just so that because seven hours is a full a full day work shift anyway um yeah i'm gonna try and find someone uh, to give uh, help us with our trolley because we have a lot of luggage and then we will go and buy some tickets the train station is really beautiful honestly like it's really nice um all of the train stations in morocco are nice in my opinion uh and this is just one of them look at the look at that that's amazing it's really really beautiful you have a train board here departure board and everything it's so so nice i just said there's no need so we are now on the train i think this is the first time that we've taken a train um, and sitting somewhere that's different as you can see like they have queues like a row of um, seats uh, there's double that's my sister over there seats for us to sit down it's not bad um it's an old train like it's quite old the train is really really old and you probably can't really hear me much um let me show you um it's not the you know it's okay this is second class um the first class tickets was first class area was full so this is the best that we have you have somewhere where you can put your stuff um to work with a cupboard and all of that kind of jazz um somewhere to store things above so yeah it's not too bad we're on the journey now and this is going to be us for seven hours my plan is to read a book and maybe edit some videos if i can we'll see see what i can achieve Um, this is a train station here in Marrakesh. It's beautiful, honestly. Like, all the train stations are so, so beautiful. Um, a lot of the train stations, like, honestly, when I think of like King's Cross, for example, but like, literally just across the country, I don't even know why I talked about King's Cross, but literally across the country, like, all the train stations are so nice. Look at this. It's so beautiful. It's so stunning. As usual, the train arrived perfectly on time um no issues whatsoever it literally i think before i was saying to myself how i thought that we we're going to go through from um fez to marrakesh and i thought there was like a different route but actually we came back to casablanca and through casablanca to come to marrakesh because i think they have one national rail route um so yeah we're here now and i think this might be my final um video talking about the trains but let me show you marrakesh station before i finish look at this beauty it's so stunning come on so beautiful honestly look at the floor it's so nice so so nice and they have this thing outside as well honestly it's so beautiful we got someone um, to help us with our luggage as usual because we have a lot of stuff um, but yeah 
I think that's it. If I don't see you, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, and I will see you somewhere in this space sometime soon.